okay, we want to know what the molar concentration of a solution made by adding 450.0 grams of copper 2 sulfate, that's CuSO4, in enough water to make 2,500 milliliters of total solution. Okay, so we want to know the molar concentration. That's going to end up moles CuSO4 over liters solution. That's what we want to end up with, those units. So we need to change grams into moles and milliliters into liters. So we're going to start CuSO4. I want to get rid of grams CuSO4 and get moles CuSO4. And I've already calculated the molar mass. I got these values off the periodic table. Those are the atomic masses of the elements. And then I multiplied oxygen by 4 and the others by 1, and I got 159.61 grams in one mole. So now grams will cancel. I've got moles. Next, I want to change from milliliters. I'll put those on top so they'll cancel to liters of solution. So one milliliter is 10 to the minus 3 liters. Uh, we don't want to confuse that. We don't want to put 10 to the minus 3 with milliliters. That's often confused. Okay, so now what are we going to do? To put it in our calculator, we're going to take 450.0. We're going to divide that by 2,500.0. Then we're going to divide that by 159.61. And then we're going to divide that by 10 to the minus 3. That's 0 .001. And this is going to equal 1.123 moles CuSO4 per liter solution. You could also write that as 1.123 capital M CuSO4, so these two things would mean the same thing. A third way you could write it is 1.123 MOLAR, molar CuSO4. The way you, you, that's wrong, we don't want to write, is 1.123 capital M over liter. That would be wrong. So these are your three options for showing how to do the units.